Okay, so hi, this is Drex, and this is uh, Toroids from uh, Ignite Fire Festival in Joshua Tree near Los Angeles, California. Uh, so we started off talking about the idea of Toroids, which uh, we discovered many years ago by essentially keeping a poi going forwards in buzzsaw as we walked around in a circle and realized that we were bending a plane in such a way that we were kind of creating this donut shape around ourselves. We played around both with the idea of keeping the poi always going the same direction in what we call isobend, or taking the poi in such a way that it switches direction each time in what we call anti-bend. We then went ahead and found an example of uh, iso-bend in a vertical kind of place where we start with the poi rotating forwards in front of us and we shoot off to our left side with the poi turning counterclockwise. We then shoot our hands straight up, making the poi go in reverse direction, and then we shoot over to the right, making it go clockwise, and finally, back down center where it goes forwards. If you look at it from the side, we have forwards, counterclockwise, reverse, clockwise. And when you get it to a point where you can do a single beat in each spot, it creates this lovely shape that looks a little bit like a plus sign, like so. We then decided that we were going to play around with some anti-bends, and the first one we played around with was a triangle. The way we did the triangle was to play around with having the poi going forwards away from us at the top of its arc, and then when it comes down at our opposite hip, we pull it in towards ourselves as though we're trying to punch ourselves in the stomach with the poi. As the poi is coming back forwards out of that, we switch to the reverse direction. We have it go reverse above us, and when it comes down at the left hip, we push it away towards the right hip, and when it reaches the right hip, we let it go vertical again, in which case we go away from us up top, pull towards us towards us up top, push away from us, away from us, towards us, towards us, away from us, away from us, towards us, towards us, away from us. And when you get to the point where you can just ricochet on through that, you get a triangle out of it. We then played around with a pentagram, which of course is the application of this same idea in such a way that we create a five-point star. The way we got there was we played around with having a forwards beat on the outside of our hand, a forwards beat on the inside of our hand, switching to a counterclockwise horizontal place, dropping into a vertical backwards on the outside, vertical backwards on the inside, and clockwise from above. We then switch back into forwards outside, forwards inside, counterclockwise, reverse outside, reverse inside, clockwise. And we practice the idea of, say, doing one, two beats of each, one, two beats, 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 and working our way down to the point where we can get in a single beat at each spot. We played the, around then with the idea of doing this in split time same direction by essentially having a buzz saw that is constantly switching direction, like so. We also played around with the idea of doing a universal hexagram, in which case we're essentially playing in a place where we've got a vertical plane a plane tilted off to the left, a vertical plane, a plane tilted off to the right. So we wind up with this lovely pattern, which is only possible to do in toroids. It is not possible to do this as an anti-spin flower, unfortunately. The way this is done is um, you basically get a same time, uh, uh, together time opposites uh, buzzsaw going, and then you switch it into a, uh, a whatchamacallit, this is almost like a buzzsaw horizontal that is going counterclockwise, and then you drop it into a uh, opposite together time buzzsaw going a different direction, and you shoot it woohoo into uh, a horizontal buzzsaw going clockwise. Then, so it becomes uh, together opposite, counterclockwise, together opposite, clockwise. Fucking brain melt. Right? <laughs> That's pretty. Yeah, big fan. Cool. And it's called? That's my favorite toroid. Uh, that's a Star David. Yeah. Very yeah, cool. A little hexagram. Great. Thank you, everyone! Yeah. Woo! Thanks, Drex! That was dope, man. Thank you. It's because there's not oh, enough video of Drex on the internet, so <laughs> no one ever.